Today, people, we are cooking with a shovel of now. That's where that shovel. again people cook and vibe my name is m the r that's connect for entertainment and we are cook and vibe you get me today people we are cooking with a shovel of no, that's with that shovel man enough yeah no shovels today people today we're doing something different today we are cooking crabs inside a pumpkin. You know what thing different, man? Our thing different, isn't it? So today, the method of cooking today, we've got the coal pot. It took me a long time to get hold of that, trust me. Yeah? So that's what we're doing today. We're gonna put a little grill on top of that. The pumpkin, crabs inside the pumpkin. Do you know what I'm saying? You're gonna need a pumpkin. <laughs> yeah, and um, basically what we've done is we've dug out the hole inside with the pumpkin. Don't waste the pumpkin, we're gonna make some soup out of that. And then, uh, yeah, we've got that ready. So what we're gonna do, oh, we're soon far with man. I'll show you what we're gonna do when we get busy. All right. <laughs> that would have been bad if I dropped that and it broke in it. <laughs> Cost us nine quid this did. How expensive is that? I'm gonna waste it, mommy. I cook some soup out of this. But yeah. Alright, so what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna put this on top of it. Yeah? Pumpkin punifier. Blue. Swimming crabs, yeah. See the blue, and they're cut in half already. You get me? So we're just gonna. Get the crabs them in there. Yeah, man. Don't forget to subscribe, please. If you're watching, don't forget to subscribe and press that bell notification button so you don't miss nothing, you see me? And likes, comments, all these things are very, very much appreciated. All comments will get replied to. We're not bossy, we're real people. And we have crabs inside a pumpkin, you see me? Come on, man, you know we do things different. You get me? So what we're gonna do now, right, is season up this little piece inside here and uh, put the lid on and put one little piece of water. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put Harrods and all these things. We're gonna put a little bit of water inside. We say that good? Yeah? yeah? And the seasonings. So we have to big up Jamaica Valley. Yeah, big up Jamaica Valley for sponsoring us. Yeah, all type of seasonings, really, really good seasonings blended up in Jamaica and then sent over to UK. Do you know what I'm saying? So today we are using the chicken, sea, the fish seafood seasoning and we're using the all-purpose seasoning. And we've got a little bit of some seafood seasoning as well. Do you know what I'm saying? So let's go in for the Jamaica Valley. Know them 
one of them. Because <laughs> you know we're not a normal cooking show. We don't do things like, oh yeah, no, no, we're going to do it 15, 20 minutes. I honestly can't tell you. And I honestly can't tell you if it's going to work. But let's hope so. It usually does, doesn't it, cook on vibe? Let's get, look, I've been asking for 4,000 likes and we seem to be getting that all right. Look, we got to step it up. we got to step it up. Can we get two bags? Can we get two bags likes on this one, please? Come on, and especially if it works. All right, I'll do your deal. If it don't work, get a thousand likes. If it works, get two bags. Why I? I can smell it from here, I can smell it when I'm just standing up waiting for the connect for to come out. We put a little bit of tin for because because we didn't have it, we had some gaps, so we just kind of made it like you know what I'm saying. Oh my days. It smells mad. It smell the crab. It smells like a good seafood smell. But at the same time, you can smell the seasonings, but at the same time. There's like a pumpkin, sweet pumpkin sort of smell going on in there as well. Nah, don't know how far these are. We've had these in there for about 20 minutes. Obviously, it's going to be longer than just boiling them, but... Ooh! I'm going to be honest, bro. That looks cooked. That looks cooked, man. Why are I? Aye, do you know what? I'm not even going to get excited yet. Have I spoiled it? I think I spoiled like the moment. I spoiled the moment. I think it's cooked. I think it's cooked, you know, blood. I think, I think you just tell Jamie on what to do now. To be honest, I don't think we should even wait to tell him. Sit down. I'll give that a few more minutes, man. Play it while I go on. I shot myself and uh, top my belly, so that's mad though. You can smell the pumpkin, man. Obviously, from the outside, there's like pumpkin inside the inside still. It's still in there. You need to scrape all of it out. It's a wicked one, man. I'm excited to try this. Why I? Um, if I'm not correct, the way I can smell this. You lot owe me two bags likes. You see what I deal with. So just forward, forward, forward. Oh yeah. Come and have a look. Come and have a look inside there. Why are, I'm telling you this smell is amazing. It's different because you see the, 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 the watermelon shrimp thing. That was completely different, but this is completely different. So yeah man. And cook, man. Is it? And cook, man. And cook, man. Why I, man? I can't believe this has worked still. Good one. pumpkin is all like mushy like at the bottom so like you can tell like the pumpkin's kind of soaked into the crab 
You get me? Where's the pink? All right, man. There we go, people. Blue swimming crab hooked inside a pumpkin. You get me? Let's have a go. Fresh, nice and fresh, but the pumpkins give it like like a vegetable y sort of taste, bro. It's wicked, man. It's wicked. There you have it, people. Shrimp. Shrimp, you know. Oh my days. Them Jamaican cigarettes, mate. You wanna see what chill out on all them, yeah, oh my <laughs> Crabs. Crabs cooked in a pumpkin. It worked really well, and it tastes really good. My guy, people. See you next week. Cook and vibe. Why I? To the way why? To the why why? Yes, and big up Braden Riley and Reese Marcel. You get me? Big up yourselves in South Africa. Big up the South Africa crew. You done know every week we're gonna pick someone out the comments and big you up. You see what I'm saying? And don't forget to send your pictures of the food that we've been cooking, your interpretation of what we've been doing. So we're gonna show you a clip here of the Bridgin who done the chicken underground like we done last week, so you can have a look what's going on here. Chicken on there somewhere. I swear down in about an hour and a half. If me take it out and it not cook, me I dash it over the next door neighbor garden. So I fall out of the sky with tin fire around him. I war.